Some people are born into the perfect life. As for the rest of us, we got there through hard work and determination. Most people wouldn't believe what they can accomplish if they just stay focused and really go after their perfect life. Self-discipline is a shortcut to happiness. I busted my ass and got the apartment I loved. A wonderful fiance. My perfect life plan was coming together. You know, I brushed my teeth. <laughs> I taste like kale. Hmm. Mm. Uh oh. It's programmed into me now, Gwen. <gasps> kale turns me on. I don't think that's what Pavlov meant. Are you sure about that? Huh. So you're still, um, working on this thing, huh? I am just editing it a little bit. I'm gonna give your mom these two tables. Oh, she'll love that. Mm -hmm. And you're sucking up to my mom. And I'm sucking up to your mom. I love you. I love you, too. Oh, hey, your lunch. Don't forget. Thank you. My life is busy. But like anyone who solved the mystery of real success, I run my life like a well-oiled machine. Let's pick up where we ended last session. My thought is, of course, the real secret to my success is these guys. Oh, we're starting. Oh, please say he's not going to talk about that dream with the blowfish again. We don't do dream analysis. We need to get him over his old office crush. It's been two years. Shh. Trying to listen. Don't assume it's for you. It could be for... Never mind. It's for you. He needs to go back to the pro-con list and remind himself why the job transfer was the wrong choice. My thought is you need to go back to the pro-con list to remind yourself why the job transfer was the wrong choice. Ready? Try and rein it in a little. I don't need to rein it in. This is a big... Oh, I see. It's perfectly healthy to question whether your boss is telling the truth. Yes. This is your territory. It really is. <laughs> Time to risk the vulnerability of telling her that you want more. <laughs> yeah. Oh. That is not a rule anyone should follow. Yeah. They've been with me for as long as I can remember. A monumental, life-altering, get you locked up if anyone ever found out about it the secret. That made me hungry. We need carbs or sugar for energy. A shot of tequila wouldn't hurt. Proper nutrition is important. She knows that includes fuel. She won't listen. She knows we're here for her. You always say that, and she always doesn't listen. She listens with her clients. Yeah, and that's it. The rest of the time, we're basically talking to ourselves. <gasps> I take it back. She does. Five bucks as she skips. It. She knows one chocolate bar won't hurt. She does love this kind. When was the last time that she actually did something that she loved? She can still listen to her heart. The inners and I understand the most fundamental truth of our success. Chocolate, 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 chocolate. No. There's safety and power in routine. 
everyone wants to feel in control of their lives. This is bullshit. Does this count as yet another step in the wrong direction? It's just a snack. I don't think it's quite on par with the other issues. Like not seeing her family in two years? Or hanging out with friends she doesn't really trust. The boring clothes, the apartment with all the shiny stuff. This office. The whole practice. The engagement photos for the society pages. She'll come to her senses. She can't live like this forever. Can we? She hasn't taken our advice seriously for years. What's the freaking point of us if she doesn't listen? She's striving for perfection. Some might call that admirable. Perfection is sucking the life out of her. I miss fun Gwen. You said the perfection thing when we were writing her thesis. You said that she was going to go back to normal after graduation. Then after her practice was established. She's still not really being herself. Those were logical predictions at the time. Well, you were wrong. You also said that if we got close to the wedding and she still wasn't totally sure about Jared, that she would bail. She is not bailing? Prince Invitations is not bailing? We have tried everything and it is not working. She is determined to live by her stupid checklist. She actually thinks that that will make her happy. I know. This is not the real Gwen, but it's the Gwen we have right now. It's not good enough. I'm done. What do you mean? I want out. What, just leave? Can we do that? We can't do that. Can we do that? Technically. You're looking well. Those visualization exercises really are empowering. <laughs> now let's begin where we left off last week. My thought is. Sorry, my thought is. Of course, all the discipline in the world can't prepare you for something like this. My thought is... Uh, I have to... Excuse me. They're not gone. They can't be gone. Where could they have gone? Five, four, three, two, one. Oh my god! I have to go to the source. When? Wenny! You. When you said you wanted to look at our old psych research, your father and I thought you were being a bit neurotic. Not that I mind. No, you were one of our star <laughs> test subjects. But, honey, this is bordering on mania or hysterics. Is that just what I am, Mom? Hysterical! Or you're trying to avoid something. Hmm? Mom, I can't explain. I just really need to find the records! Okay. Thank you! You always were a precocious kid. You blew those other test subjects right out of the water. Yeah, such discipline. And you never minded the electrodes. Ah! This is you. Sometimes looking into the past... When? ...can be dangerous. Hey, Allie. <laughs> so you basically, you threw me out of the bathroom window. <laughs> the cops showed up. <laughs> oh, God, that was the last time we partied with those guys. Yeah. It was our last night together. It was a good night. You left before I woke up. I had to. And you forgot to end it first. I didn't mean to i figured you'd never come back here yeah well we both pinkies were on that one you want a tart come on you could use something sweet and it's for charity oh well if it's for charity then of course <laughs> ah! hello gwen <laughs> watch it <gasps> I'm locked in the attic, I can't